Hey guys, how are you doing? I'm back with the new video about the retrofit library. In the last video, I told you I'm going to show you some uh, practical examples using retrofit library. This is one of them. Today, we are going to build this application, which is a list of uh, popular memes that uh, maybe we are using them in our conversations with our friends. Uh, some of them are familiar for you, maybe and uh, uh, the purpose is uh, to show you how to fetch the images from the url and uh, display them in the recycler view using picasso library and the retrofit library as the uh, main library to manage the http request if you are ready hit the subscribe button hit the bell button and give me a thumbs up and let's get started as always uh, before i start recording i've done some of the necessary stuff here in the main activity i have the stuff for the view binding in the build.gradle i have the build feature for the view binding and also i have added these dependencies and you can find them down below in the description box and in the manifest i have the internet permission in the main activity uh, layout i have the constraint layout a toolbar just to show the name of the application uh, this toolbar is holding a text view a progress bar and a recycler view and uh, the layout manager of this recycler view is going to be uh, a staggered uh, grid layout because the size of images are not equal and uh, here i have created a new uh, layout for the recycler view uh, there is a card view here a constraint layout uh, image view and text view and that's so simple just like this okay uh, let's implement the rest of the stuff together let's go to the project and here create a new package and i'm going to call it models and this package is supposed to hold the data classes for us let's take a look at the url and the data the JSON file uh, that we are going to uh, get from the URL. This is the URL that we are going to work with it. The base URL is here and the endpoint is here. And this is the uh, JSON file that we are going to get in the response. Uh, let's go to the postman. If you don't know what is the postman, don't worry. Uh, this is a website to check the URLs and you are going to paste the URL here press the send and the JSON file will appear here okay uh, we have image ID and name and I'm going to use only the name and the image and the rest of the stuff uh, are not important okay I am going to copy the whole uh, JSON file. Then let's go to the Android Studio. Right click on the models, new, and I'm going to use this plugin. If you don't know how to use it and you don't have it, come to the setting. To the plugins here uh, in the marketplace, search for this JSON to cut lane. And after finding it, install it. Then. Uh, this widget will appear here okay so i'm going to paste the json here and we need a name here i'm going to call it or all memes data generate here now we have three classes uh, this class is uh, created by us 
and I think I need one more E here. Then inside it we have this data. Let me delete this and also this. And inside this data we have uh, instance of this class and this class is holding all of the data that we need and as i told you we need this name and the url okay let's go further the next step is to create another package calling it data inside the package data we need an interface api interface inside this api interface we are going to use get annotation and we need the endpoint here and it was uh, get underscore memes then a suspend function calling it get memes nothing in the body and the response will go to the all memes data data class we are done here let's go further we need another package Call it utils inside this again a new class which is object I'm going to call it util and here constant value base equals to the URL let me copy and paste it here and the next step will be another object and I'm going to call it retrofit instance Here we need the uh, value, call it API uh, instance of API interface by lazy. And as I told you, this lazy is something like the late init variable. That means we are not going to initialize it right now, but later we will initialize it. retrofit dot builder dot base url will be util dot base then dot uh, add converter factory json converter factory dot create then dot build then dot create and api interface class.jav let me zoom and you can see it better if you want to copy that but uh, don't worry you can find the whole source code in my github link down below in the description and here also we had this okay nothing else here 
let's create a new package calling it adapter and here we need a class for the recycler view adapter rv adapter First of all here we need a private value I'm going to call it meme list which is list of the class meme import it then this class as inheritance of the recycler view dot adapter and here or the adapter dot view holder and create this class here in the adapt then implement members all of the members and uh, Cycler view dot view holder and here binding dot root. Okay, uh, get item count return uh, meme list dot size. And uh, here in the on create view holder, we are going to write return to the view holder rv uh, item binding dot inflate layout inflator from. parent dot context and comma parent comma false uh, that's everything here for now later we are going to uh, set the data here on the elements of the recycler view let's go to the main activity uh, to write the codes to uh, manage the request and fetch the data okay here in the main activity I'm going to write the global scope dot launch dispatchers dot io response equals to try uh, retrofit instance dot api dot get memes then catch uh, 
io exception another catch HTTP exception and here we are going to write two toast messages uh, to see the error so application context and here App error dollar sign Kelly braces e dot uh, message return launch here the same Okay, then if the response that is successful and response has body is not equal to null. then with context dispatchers dot main uh, now I'm going to create a new private Lighting it variable and calling it uh, RV adapter instance for the recycler V adapter. And here memes list. which is list of the meme class equals to response dot body dot data dot memes then binding dot uh, apply here progress bar uh, dot visibility uh, equals to view dot invisible or maybe gone then recycler v adapter equals to rv adapter and we are passing the meme list to the adapter then The adapter of the recycler view is equal to uh, recycler view dot adapter equals to 
equals to rv adapter and uh, recycler view dot layout manager equals to stacker grid layout manage we need two factors here the span count two that means in a single row two items should be displayed and then recycler view dot vertical and that's it let's go to the recycler view and uh, set the data on the elements okay here uh, i'm going to create a value calling it current item equals to meme list and passing the position here then holder dot binding dot apply text view dot text equals to uh, current item dot name and picasso dot get dot load the url current item dot should be here yeah url then dot into image view and i think everything is done let's check it on the emulator okay the app is here and works perfectly and you can see all of the pictures okay that was everything about this video if you have any comment any question or any request for new videos please write down below in the description box and i will uh, make the videos based on your requests if you are satisfied of this kind of videos uh, tell me in the comment box below and i will make more videos like this the practical videos i mean and uh, if you are satisfied of the content of the channel please give me a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed the channel uh, please subscribe to the channel and hit the bell button to be aware about the new videos have a awesome day thank you very much and bye bye